Hey, how's it going? Today I'm going to teach you how to play Sepulturus Refuse Resist. A quick thing about the tuning, the song is generally in D standard, so that would mean you tune your E down to a D, your A down to a G, your D down to a C, your G down to an F, your B down to an A, and your E down to a D. But I'm going to teach it to you in drop D tuning, so that means you keep your guitar in standard tuning, but drop the lower string down to a D. The reason for this is because generally most of you have got your guitars tuned in normal tuning and that way you've only got to tune one string down rather than having to tune your whole guitar out. But if you have already got a guitar that's in D standard, all you've got to do is when I play a chord on the sixth fret, uh, you know, sorry, on the low string, whatever fret I'm on, uh, I play it in this, this way, like in drop D style, but it, all you've got to do is play it as usual, like these. Okay, and also, on these five strings, whenever I play something, you're going to move it up two frets. So, for instance, I'm on the third fret, you would play it on the fifth fret. So, say there's a riff that goes up. All that's going to mean is basically, you know, I'm playing three, two, and then four, three on the low strings. You would play five, four, and then the four, three. Okay, hope that makes sense. The intro riff starts off. So you can hear we're doing all palm muting, and that's starting off on the first fret, played four times to the open, but played once, and that's going to be down, up, down, up, down. So you've got. And that's played four times, really easy. After the intro, we go into our main riff. Okay, and this is playing the sixth fret, played four times, and then the open once. So you've got. And that's doing down, up, down, up, down. And you play that two times round, so you've got. Then you're going to play the 6 once and the open twice, and that's going to be down, up, down. You add that to the end of those two, so you've got... And then you just repeat that riff. That's the same all the way through the song when it comes up. Apart from one time when it goes uh, just before the second verse, it's played four times, and on the fourth one you've got this variation. We've got... So all that's doing is the first uh, four sixes, and then one open, and then we're going to do ten sixes palm muted. So you've got... All down ups. just before you go into the second verse. This is the riff that happens before the first verse, and it goes... Okay, and that's starting off on the sixth fret, power chord low string. We play that once, then we're going to play two percussive, just uh, letting the fingers sit across the strings. Just getting that dead mute sound. We're going to play it. So that was down, down, up. Then you're going to play the second fret on the A string, power chord. Then you're going to play a power chord on the fifth fret of the A string twice. So you've got. Okay, you play that three times and then you go into this. So that's playing the low open chords on the low string five times and muted in between each of those. So you've got... And we're muting it obviously with this hand, letting the fingers sit across the strings lightly to deaden it over there, and then putting the palm across the strings to deaden it also over there. So that riff again. verse riff 
And all we're doing is we're playing the open chord five times. The first four are palm muted, and then the fifth one is then it's really open. And you're going to get down, up, down, up, down. Then you get the frets one, three, four, and that's pa uh, power chords. If you're in standard tuning, obviously you know you should play it like this. But if we're in drop D tuning, then um, I personally play it in one, three, four, same thing as the frets. If you're not comfortable using your little finger doing power chords, you could possibly either do one, two, and three, or one, one, two. So this is the way I'm doing it though. And that's the verse. This chorus riff, we're going to start off, we're going to slide into the 8th fret, roughly from the 4th fret, so we're going to slide into the 8th fret power chord, we're going to go... And that was, once we've slid into the 8th fret, we're going to do down, up, down, down, so we've got... Then we're going to slide up to the 4th fret. Once you're at that full fret, you're going to play it three more times with downs. And then you're going to play the open chord. So you go. That's the first one. The second one, we're going to slide into the sixth fret. And we've got down, down, up, down, down, down. Full fret down and over down. That was the third one is the same chords as the first one. We're going to slide into the eighth fret. We're going to play three downs after that. So you go, and you can hear after we've done the three downs, we're going to slide up to the fourth one. Play the full fret again, the down, and then the over, and the down. And then the fourth one we're going to do. Okay, and now we're sliding into the six again. And that's playing down, down, up, down, 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 down. The last one being on the full fret. Okay, the only other thing you need to know on the second chorus, when we do the fourth one, we're going to do... So that's exactly the same as that uh, second one you do in the chorus. So the second chorus, you play basically the first one, second one, first one, second one again. This is the riff that's leading into our solo. <laughs> Okay, and that's doing power chords on the A string, going 3, 2, 2. Okay, so power chords, 3, 2, 2. Power chords on a low string, 4, 3, 3. Then you're going to do, on the A string power chords, 3, 2, 2, 3, 2, 2. So all together. One more time. This is the riff that happens behind the solo. We've got. etc. And that's playing the third fret power chord once and then the second fret on the lowest string. So we've got. That's the first rhythm we need to know. And that's down, down, up, up, down. So the first one is on the third fret, and then all the rest are on the second. Okay, and we've just got a slight palm mute on this, we're not digging in deep. Just a slight one, so the palm just slightly on the string. Okay, so the first rhythm. So down, down, up, up, down. And then you're going to play down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up.
and then it gets pretty fast so really listen to it make sure that your guitar is not turned up too loud so you can't hear the record if you're playing along with it and just watch out for the speed so you got and then it's going to go back into that etc all we've got left now is our outro riff and it's exactly the same as the intro we just played a we just play it four times same as you did on the intro and then we add one more and we just play and that's just palm you in the first fret and then we play the open without any palm you in so yeah. and that's all we need to know Thanks for watching, if there's any other songs or riffs you'd like me to do videos for, leave a comment down below, I'll see you next time.